I'm back. Hi, my name is Tim, and I have been uh, chronicling my uh, weight loss journey and uh, my bariatric uh, gastric. I'm sorry, gastric sleeve uh, surgery. T minus four days, and I gotta adjust this a little bit. T minus four days. Uh, Monday will be uh, my surgery, uh, November 2nd, and I uh, figured I'd change the environment too. It's gorgeous out here. I live in uh, southern Louisiana, and it's just gorgeous. Just watered my cauliflowers and excited about uh, seeing the growth there, and those are vegetables I can actually eat down the road. <laughs> so, let me get you caught up. If you haven't watched my last video, uh, T minus 11 days until my surgery. I, I recommend you do because I, I put a little video of my uh, endoscopy. Uh, I've never had one before and so I had that uh, done and uh, just a little video of my innards. <laughs> so uh, I don't know what they were looking for but anyways uh, it was all good. Everything I've done up until now, doctor's appointments, most of them by uh, video uh, Teladoc uh, and uh, Health Anywhere apps. I have been weighed and measured and <laughs> and not found wanting. Okay. Uh, movie ref, just in case. I, I love movies and uh, anyways. So, I've had blood work done. I've had a COVID uh, 19, uh, COVID test. Ugh. That was horrible. Um, and like shoving stuff way up your nose there, but uh, I've had um, I've been doing a pre-surgery diet, pretty much four ounces of protein uh, and two cups of uh, vegetables or greens, not starchy. Got to avoid those starches. No carbs. And to be honest with you, I don't I don't miss the carbs until my coworkers are eating French fries and Chick Fil A and hamburgers on buns <laughs> and uh, here I am eating my little four ounce. No, I'm, I'm pretty content. Uh, all set, ready to rock and roll. I believe um, it's going to go well and I will video on Monday morning before I go under and then after I'll be in the hospital recovering for a day. Uh, it's been excellent. I mean the comments people have been uh, sharing with me uh, those who have had the uh, sleeve surgery in the past, I'm going to show you a picture of my uh, younger brother. His name is Tony. He had this procedure three years ago, and uh, now he's a CrossFit nut and running all kinds of things and all. But I want to show you a picture of him with me uh, as my big old fat self, and uh, he, he's just been an, an example. For me, of what what's going, what can happen if I uh, really take this thing serious, which I am and I will. Anyways, a lot of encouragement, some tips. I'll be looking forward to some recipes down the road because my eating uh, will change, uh, has to change. Uh, my capacity will be smaller, and uh, uh, so I don't want to hurt myself either. But uh, I'm excited. Everyone's asking me all day today, are you scared? Are you scared? And I'm like, uh, no. Am I, am I supposed to be? <laughs> I don't know. But uh, my doctor, uh, the surgeon, actually, I, I talked with him yesterday. and uh, we're, we're pretty good. We're all set to go. And um, he's excited. Thinks I'm going to do really good. Um, and I will let you know more about all the supplements I have to take, the chewables, uh, the various uh, drinks I got to have uh, in the beginning there to help me uh, for, to avoid some of the pitfalls uh, post-surgery. And um, yeah, so I'm going to uh, sign off so I can show you some uh, some of the video club, some of the pictures, uh, and then I'll come back and say goodbye. Thank you.
enjoyed those pictures. And uh, I want to, first of all, introduce you to my lovely wife, Christina. Uh, she is my number one supporter for this uh, procedure, and it's been amazing. We've been reading over our manual, which is pretty much the Bible for this surgery, on what to eat and what supplements and how much protein, this, that, and the other thing. So she's been absolutely amazing. So I wanted to introduce her to her and ask her a few things. Honey, tell them your name. Christina. <laughs> We've never done this before. This is fun. So, baby, tell them, tell them how it's been like in the last couple of weeks with me getting ready. Well, he's been doing great. He's been losing weight because he's eating the um, low carb, well, no carbs for two weeks, right? And um, he's been going over that notebook, and we've been going over it together, and going over it one more time, and going over it again. And there's a mosquito. And um, yeah, it's been he's been pretty on point. So, how have you tolerated me being fat for so long? <laughs> you can't ask that question. <laughs> <laughs> I told I'm him. not happy that he's not healthy and that he doesn't want to do anything. I told him the story that we were at Boston uh, and we were there <laughs> with the Boston Harbor years. Seals. That was and, before children. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, 265, imagine one of them rolling over on you. And you said... Uh, you said. You said. You said. I, I, I said imagine. And no, you said, I said imagine and you no, said no, I no, weigh no, that no. much. See, old age is getting to her. I said imagine and you said you don't have to. I don't have to. <laughs> Anyways. TMI. <laughs> no, it's just fun. But I, this, I couldn't do this without her. Um, just, you got to have support. In fact... With the doctors, they kept asking, who's your support, who's your support, who's your support? So, uh, and she's uh, going to take advantage of the heating, uh, like I yeah, am. Yeah, I put on 20 pounds of COVID. So. <laughs> COVID 20. Anyways, um, I just wanted you to meet her and just have some fun. And What are you looking forward to with me losing all this weight? Playing with the children, the grandchildren. And uh, going for walks together, and how about playing golf? Playing golf. <laughs> See that? Learning right. how to play golf. You heard it here, folks. Anyways. Uh, oh, him getting a third job so that we can afford to play golf. <laughs> anyways, if you feel my pain. <laughs> anyways, uh, what I also need to say before I sign off is this: um, we have been. Uh, my insurance, I told you before, my insurance won't cover it, and so we're self-pay, and thank God that I had someone that was willing to uh, to uh, chip in and help out with it. Um, I had to take a loan for, for the other part, and, uh, you know, we just believe in uh, God that, you know, he'll provide, because this had to happen, and it had to happen now, because uh, the longer you wait to put it off, it's not going to happen. So, if you're thinking about doing it, don't put it off. And if your spouse is with you 100%, definitely don't put it off. And if your insurance company won't cover it, pray and ask and see if, uh, if there be a way made, okay? So with all that said, I, I want you to see my little sign. <laughs> this is what my mother-in-law had. Make sure you like this video, comment on this video, and please subscribe and uh, ring that bell, touch that bell, because it lets you know every time I put up a video, okay? Ding, ding. <laughs> and, uh, and then I also remember my phrase now. I got this a couple weeks back. Uh, I used to live to eat, love to eat, and that's how I got in this mess. And now, readjusting my mind, and my thinking, and I eat to live, not live to eat. Thank you.